Hi, this is Michael from DHCW. I just want to do a quick, um, show you a quick way of how to configure your vSphere web client to allow you to log in without having to log in with the full um, domain. So right now, with vSphere 5.1 web client, if I try to log in with my domain account, it will give me a false error thinking that my credential is not, it's not valid. But I know my credentials is valid because if I add my domain to it, it will let me log in. All right, so it lets me log in. Or if I was to log in with my domain in front of it, it will let me log in. But if I try to log in with my just my um, domain account and won't let me log in. And the reason being that by default, the system dash domain is the default domain. So let me log in. In order to change the default domain to your um, actual directory domain, you have to log in with the admin account. In the admin account, you have to use the password that was configured when we're installing single sign-on. Okay, so you log in with the admin account, click on administration, click on configuration underneath sign on and discovery. Now, when you were doing your single sign on, if it was part of an active directory, you should have the LDAP URL in here for your um, domain. So go ahead and click on your domain and then click on this error right here. See the error? Add to default domains, click on that. And then click OK that you know you have multiple domains, that's fine. Click OK. Now go ahead and move your domain to the very top. So use the arrow to move it all the way to the very top. You may see this right here that keeps spinning. Just ignore it. So once you move your domain to the top, go ahead and hit the save button. And that will save it. So now your domain is the default domain. This will allow you to log in without having to use your domain name. So I'm going to go ahead and log out as admin. And now I'm going to log in with my domain account. Earlier when I tried this, it was saying that my credentials were not valid. But now that I've set my domain as the default domain, it should allow me to log in without any issues. Authenticate in and it will let me log in. So this is how you can change single sign on on vSphere 5.1 to allow you to log in with your domain account without having to specify your domain. Hope this helps. All right. Thanks.